Alrighty, hello everyone. Welcome to this week's stream. I am Miyumini, and this time I don't have any little uh, French phrase to butcher, so I'm just going to go ahead and launch Valheim. And. Hmm? Let me do a gear icon, library page. I'm using Vulcan. What the hell is Vulcan? We'll just play Valheim this time. That's a new one. Um, let's see here. Considered Valheim.exe. Well, that's interesting. Let's go ahead and try using Vulcan. Oh, there it is. Don't know what was going on there. And another weird thing. No? We good? We good, game? I think we're good. No, it died again. Interesting. Well, instead of that, then let me go ahead and go with the backup. Do do do. Bear with me. Ma, 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 ma. Well then, if the Valheim is going to be dumb, and I don't know why it uh, was doing that, I'm just going to go ahead and launch my favorite game, which is uh, RimWorld. Let me get this in here. Is updated okay so what I'll go ahead and do here is I'm just gonna go ahead and start a new colony I'm gonna do a vanilla playthrough um, let's see here that requires all sorts of uh, mods so I'm not doing that I'm just gonna go with a fairly basic run let's see yeah we'll do the you know oh, what is the term the initial, the vintage, uh, crash landed, and we'll go with, eh, we'll go with an adventure story, and I'm going reload anytime because, eh, yeah, why not? We can always change it to later. Uh, randomize seed. We'll do all those pollution. Yep, yep. We'll go ahead and generate that. And who knows, as uh, time goes on, maybe I'll add some mods to this and, uh, you know, things like uh, simple sidearms and things like that. Um, let's see, while that's generating that, I'm going to close my door here. just select a random site here and then keep on hitting random until I get what I want let's see which the main things I'm looking for right now is in the stone types I'm doing marble and I also want granite granite because it's the hardest rock type and marble because it's the prettiest marble and granite and oh growing period is all year round so yeah looks like we'll go ahead and set up shop in this little arid shrubland and we'll go ahead and do a custom uh, ideology in. And we'll go ideological. And because I'm a big old dirty commie, I'm going to go ahead and do a collectivist 
ideology. And we'll call this stream eology. We'll call it streamological. Call it the, I don't know, studio, den of iniquity. And then, yeah, I kind of like that purple. What's a good symbol? Um, maybe something that like that looks kind of like a bra. Oh, there we go. It's a nice little beacon. You know, because streaming. Yeah, it wakes. There we go. Next. Uh, let's see here. Slavery, bad, drug use, whatever. Uh, child labor encouraged. We're gonna um, remove that. Uh, female clothing, I don't care. Male clothing, I don't care. Slavery, honorable, no. Uh, abhorrent, we'll say. Or actually, do we just want it horrible? Organ use, no. Cannibalism, no. Work drive, triple. That's good, because that'll keep things going. Diversity of thought, research. And yeah, we'll keep it normal for now. Physical love, free and approved, because, yeah, why not? Uh, male clothing, no rules. Spouses, only one. Spouses, only one. Random name for who keeps what. Corpses are ugly. Um, fungus, whatever. Insect meat, don't like. Scarification, skull spike. Um, to keep things moving, we'll make it very fast. Uh, woken leader. Um, what do we want to call this? Woken leader, woken leader. We'll call it streamer. Yeah. And visits mask. That doesn't make any sense. Let's go ahead and do. I don't really care. So we'll go ahead and leave that. Uh, moral guide, streamological moralist. We'll edit this, we'll remove that. Do we want to do anything else? Streamological producer? Um, director? Yeah, we'll go with director. All right, done. Uh, relics. Do we want... Edit. Uh, we'll remove, remove, remove real quick. Add relic. What do we want? We'll do a cube and an arc and a box. Um, Let's see, undivided eulogy. Um, we'll call this end of stream raid. Streamological advent. Well, we call this uh, we'll say, okay, since this can only happen like once a year, we'll call it Charity stream? Because I'm thinking like the Yogg's cast and stuff like that. They do their jingle jam in the month of December. Um, done with that. And then Solitary Jubilee. Uh, t -t 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 anytime. And we'll call this... Games and Chat. Because that's kind of what I want to do. Uh, games and chat. Okay, done with that. Uh, add a weapon pair. Do I want? No, not really. Venerated animals. Do I want to do anything like that? Not really. I mean, alpacas are nice, but. Hmm. 
I'm not really seeing anything that says, that, you know, speaks to me really. Maybe? No, no, no. We're going to go ahead and remove that. Preferred xenotypes, nothing there. Do we really care about that? Not really. I don't want to do the whole that. Okay, now let's take a look at hair. Minimal, yep. Uh, I'm okay with tats. Some of these tats, at least. Spider, no. Tear, yes. Headshot, why not? Love, yeah. Stars, okay. And then body tattoo, fine. Tiger, buttons, rings. Scar and spike, sure. Uh, heart and wound and royal. And sun. Okay, now let's take a look at hair. Um, that's normal. What are we looking at? Go with rear. Normal. Because I like I like that haircut. What can I say? Um, fire starter. Junkie scrapper. We'll go with normal. Randy. Randy. One Lackland, yeah, Revolt, Pigtails, Afro, Bob, no. Cute. Decent fancy bun fringe. Snazzy, brief ponytail, princess. Yes, we'll go with that. Scatman, no. I don't care how catchy the song is, no. Beards. I have to sneeze. Hey, Kevin Kitsune, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for giving me eyes. Uh, how are you doing today? Wizard Harry. Uh, don't like that one. Mutton Chop, sure. Mustache, machete. Alright, um. Okay, do it that. And next. Uh, let's see. Creepy breathing, that's fine. Wimp, no, we're not doing that. Um, teetotaler, you're a bit. F no. Beautiful misogynist can burn in hell. Abrasive and eccentric, that's fine. Kind. Hearing loss, scratch scar. Okay. Doing relatively well. Just got back from the dentist. That's good, that's good. Your, your teeth in good shape? Let's see here. Oh, team skills, there we go. Plants. Yeah, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and make this our starting uh, crash landers. All right. Three of you awake in your crypto sleep sarcophagi to the sound of sirens and ripping metal. You barely get to the escape pods before the ship is torn apart. Sometime later, you land on, an, on this unknown rim world. As pieces of shredded starship fall around you, you start making plans to survive. All right, now, wait a minute. Oh, sweet, I got a monkey. All right, let's take a look at what we're dealing with here. And I know there are going to be mods that I usually have that I am going to miss terribly. Uh, let's see, first, what is difficult for moving around? It's not telling me what is fertile soil. Okay, so I think Grow some crops up over here. Probably build the base actually in here. Yep, seems like a plan. Alright, attack orders, zones. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and 
zone. And let's see, what kind of floors do I have? Those. Kind of, kind of that. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine plants that I really kind of want to grow. So let's see, 19. Okay. I do have a plan here. I'm gonna grow plants in like little six by six chunks here. And then um, Yeah. Words are hard when you're distracted. Get a root canal today. Ugh, that is no bueno. Um, hopefully, though, they've got you on on the good stuff, though. All right, let's see. We will go ahead and go with potatoes here, and corn here, and rice there, and do some strawberries. Yes, I know I can't grow them right now. Some heel root. Yes, I know I can't grow that right now. And then some cotton, because we'll need that for clothing. Some smoke leaf, because God knows we're going to need something to keep us busy. And some tint corn. And what was the last thing I was going to do? Crap in a hat. Was it hops? I don't think it's hops, is it? Maybe it was hops. Because they won't like the fungus. Yeah, I think it was hops. Okay. Um, Alright, so we're going to go ahead and not do that one until we get, like, you know, brewing. Uh, tint stuff will be needed. Smoke leaf. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Work. Work, 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 everybody work. Oh, right. All right, and then we'll do priorities or that. We'll make you the doctor. Uh, there's no kids right now. You're the cook. All of you should be trying to grow things. And we'll have you do research, everybody cleans, everybody hauls. You can do the make stuff. And what should we have for Taylor? I guess our animal person? Yeah, seems that way. All right, so Taylor will give you the gun. And then who's got the better stats? Eddie's got a seven. Loka's got a four, but is passionate. So we'll give Loka that. And Eddie will get the knife. All right. And there's some starting gear. What's tint corn? Uh, that's not a crop I'm familiar with. Um, tint corn, uh, with the ideology, or ideology and whatever it's called, um, the latest expansion, um, you can tint your clothes or you can paint your walls and floors and stuff like that. So you have um, options on colors now. So you don't have to have all the shirts be the same. Um, your colonist hats will have a favorite color now. And so if you have like, three-fifths of their clothing being this color um uh this color here uh they'll get a mood boost um so there's you know it's it kind of helps give a little variation with with the colonists and i use the term colonists as opposed to pawns because i don't know i'm one of those uh 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 merciful weirdos um 
I like my colonists to actually be happy. <laughs> but we will see. Let's see, schedule. Um, all right, so I like to give them a lot of free time. Let's see. And then this way, if they want to sleep, they're more than welcome to sleep. But uh, if they want to be up and doing stuff, they can be up and doing stuff. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Let's see. Assign. Everybody attack. Animals. Punk. Uh, that is fine. Wildlife. What do we got? Rhinos, bisons, cougars, emus, boom bats, and rabbits. We will come to you in a moment. No quests. Let's see. We got hostels pretty close to us, but one friendly. Okay. I think we can go ahead and start this up. Let's see. Orders. That is good. Zone. Structure furniture. Let's try getting people some beds here. So first off, one, two, three, Oleri. Power. Leave that eventually. Oh, right, we should probably have some zones for, like, where to put stuff and keep things from rotting to hell and back. sands out here are our trash heap. Alright, let's kick this into high gear. Um, bum, bum, bum. Temperature. We will go ahead and make a campfire to help cook up some foods. And then eventually we'll get a passive cooler, but that'll be when uh, we're actually digging into the interior here. Uh, let's see. What do we got? We'll go with a wooden wall for now. steel right now so I'm trying to figure I want to start building rooms in here so I have an ideology just never mess with the color stuff oh yeah it's it's neat it's neat um, it's not it's nothing huge in my experience it's just kind of a it allows for that much more personalization is what I find Door here. And we'll do a little wallage here when they wake up. Come and knock on out. Got a place for the food. I always hate this part. It's like, oh, okay, guess we'll just twiddle our thumbs now. Oh, Eddie's awake now. And should probably start with stuff like getting a crafting spot built, a butcher spot, and eventually we'll get this other stuff. Yeah, what the hell, we'll do a fueled stove, stone cutters, and the hand tailors. And 
Una research bench. Rocks. Here. Okay, good. Sleep. Yeah, uh, never mind that. One of you, like, I don't know, move that. Thank you. Let's see, structure, furniture. There's, oh, there it is. That's what I need. Um, I need shelves, otherwise, all this shit's going to rot and decay outside. Okay. So, stuff like the medicine. You should be put on a shelf. And the food should also be put on a shelf. all have pants? It looks like you have pants. Yes, that's why that one pair of pants was just sitting there. Okay, good to know. Um, Taylor, could you make sure the nice pants don't uh, rot away? Okay, thanks. And what do we want to do? We can make hats. And face mask and and duster and cape. And a sash, because why not? I'm feeling very sashy. What can I say? And this way, there's just always a backup of like each of these things. The sash is not very high priority, though. put the duster higher up. Okay, what's this say? Oh, we have a visitor. Cave builder from Roca Coalition, uh, Coalition is visiting the colony. She is named Blue Leopard. Dabu dee, dabu die. All right, Blue. Now, let's see, who's got good socials? Loka, not Taylor, not Eddie. All right, let's see. Can we trade with... Hello? Eh, I would like to trade. Them. Okay, so you're just wandering around here. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh, let's see here, structure. We'll go ahead and make this a door. And keep on telling people to mine stuff. Do, 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 do. Oh, okay, well, it was nice seeing you, I guess. Roca Coalition. I think those are the friendlies, right? Yeah, Roca Coalition. Okay. And we've got food. Um, well, we'll just start off with simple meals. And say stop when you got ten of them. Smoothing there. Let's see. Need 
recreation. All right, we'll do a horseshoe pin there, and we'll do a chess table. Ah, damn it. There, mad iguana. Local iguana has gone mad. It will attack everyone it sees. Is it coming right for us? No, it's on the other side here. Yeah, let's go hunting. Where is it? There, so we'll go this way. Come on, you scaly bastard! Show me what you got! Eddie, you go down here. You stab and kick. There we go. Good job, team. Uh, no, don't rescue the iguana. Kill it. And speaking of killing things, should probably have a thing to butcher creature and make kibble. Uh, we'll just say do forever there. And kibble. Until we, uh, I like to do two types of kibble. One to just get rid of the bad meat, um, and then one for um, like normal amounts of kibble. Not up first. All right. Now we'll go ahead and put two of these inside here. That way they don't get the oh, I had to sleep outside uh, debuff here. Okay, chess table needs chairs. You need chairs. Um, we'll just put some stools down. That way it doesn't use up a bunch of stuff. And uh, who's the best digger? Mining one, mining zero, mining eight. Okay, Eddie, I want you to dig that rock when you're done. Thank you. And now we can put this bed in here. Oh. Since it looks like you'll be here for a while, Taylor thinks you should give your faction a name. What should your faction be called? Um... We'll call this the Meanies. And Taylor also thinks you should give your settlement a name. What should this local settlement be called? Uh, we'll call this Dreamland. You know, for this first one. And we'll call this Meus. Meanies. There we go. This 
smoothing wall. Oh, that's what they're doing. Okay. Ah. Cargo pod. You have detected a cluster of cargo pods crashing nearby. Perhaps you'll find something useful in the wreckage. Jump to... Oh, yes. That is quite useful. And, oh, right. I should probably go ahead and move myself. I think I can go up here? Yes. Hmm. This feels weird, but okay. Um, that way you can see what I'm doing over here. Ancient danger. As Taylor draws near the ancient wall, a sense of foreboding overcomes him. He isn't sure why, but he feels that this dusty structure may contain great danger. And maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. I ain't gonna find out right now, because I don't want to wipe right away. Go ahead and move that granite chunk out the way. Eddie, if you'd be so kind. Wait, no, first. Eddie, move the rock. Thank you. All right, so it's 81 in there and 77 out here, so they'll probably be bitchy that they were. Eh, it was warm. You're warm. All right. We'll give this some roofing. We'll make this part of the home zone. Fox is hunting Punk the monkey. Run, Punk, run! Um, first, I'm going to create this little area one. And I'm going to tell Punk to get inside. There we go. Now it's going to go off and do whatever the hell it wants. Go away, puppy. Go away. No, don't eat my food! Oh, rat bastard dog. Well, at least he won't be hungry for Monkey. Although, Punk, you should stay in the home area now. And fast forward. Oh, okay. It's considered comfortable there. Awful barracks, soaking wet, disturbed sleep. Okay. Not too bad yet. And should also go ahead and set this up for multiple rooms. So I'll put beds in three of these and then okay, we'll workshop here. <sighs> Toxin unit. A group of wasters from Toxin unit have arrived nearby. They will prepare for a while, then attack. Prepare a defense or attack them preemptively. They're hostile. Oh, it's just like one guy with a knife. All right. Well, go get her, Ray. Are you any good? No. All right. Well, you're good at social. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, sweet. Okay. Awesome. So. First off, we'll take his money. And which one of you is our doctor? Medical, medical. Okay, it's Eddie. Yes, we'll go ahead and give this a try. 
Eddie, capture. Didn't think I'd have to set up a prison this quickly. Do a steel bed and two more sleeping spots. And who was our miner again? Bleeding to death at all? Technically, yes. Damn it. Alright, well. Hurry up getting him back. And then you go have a lie down, and we'll have someone else patch you up. Okay, Loka, you're not busy. You treat Eddie. Stop dying! There we go. No more dying for Eddie. Oh, he's probably bleeding to death still, isn't he? Uh, yes. Um, Taylor, try tending to him and uh, take his clothes. Eh, he's just got some shitty pants, that's fine. Prisoner, so first I'm gonna try to convert him to streamiology. And if that works, then we'll go ahead and try to recruit him because shooting and social, I'll give it a shot. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Everybody, <laughs> you can have your beds back. Group of poor travelers are approaching, looking for help. The travelers are begging for two medicine. They need the medicine to help a friend nearby. Uh, right click, okay. How much medicine do I have? 29? Fine. Now fuck off. And we need to do something with him, because Eddie, it's nice that you have uh, are very relaxed like that, but that's a little creepy. Um, burn the peril drone. Okay, misc. We will dig a hole in the ground. There. Engine mech passing near the remains of an ancient exostrider mechanoid. Loka noticed an intact transponder. Uh, if you could get the transponder, you could read valuable information from it. The massive mech is smashed and fused into a solid piece. You must destroy it to retrieve the transponder. Be careful, the incendiary weapon cells look unstable and will likely detonate after you do some damage. So, boom. Boom to gasser. All right, and it looks like they went ahead and plopped him in. I can do to fix you up. Aside from amputating your ears. <laughs> no. Um, no, worked. Um, you know, you guys could do this other stuff. Not saying, I'm just saying, guys. There. Sleeping in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood, and to do and stuff and all right and stone cutters. I want you 
first make me some granite for exterior walls, then some marble for interior walls, and then whatever you feel like. So we'll say 2,000, 2,000, and 6,000. of spacecraft have impacted nearby. You can deconstruct them to yield resources. Yes, yes, I can. I was wondering why they weren't making any progress on this stuff. Unusual heat wave has begun. Heat waves can induce deadly heat stroke. Stay cool by building either a passive or electric cooler, or by getting deep underground where the rocks are naturally cool. Natch. Alright. First, just smash any mechanoids. And then we'll do weed and weed and a bow and a knief. available the solitary kini uh, andronos a knight of imperium of eternity is calling from nearby his guards were killed in an ambush he escaped but is now being followed by a man hunting monkey um, andronos wants you to keep him safe at streamland for a few hours until his shuttle can come pick him up uh, he'll bestow eight honor on whoever accepts this request Enough to receive the title of Yeoman, and all the benefits that come with it, including first level psychic powers. Who would I want that? Kind, creepy, breathing, abrasive, and ascetic. Expecting a little bit of a uh, are you sure thing. All right then. Andronos joins. You will keep in the home area. Now we need a meditation spot for. Was it Eddie? That is dead. 
an ostrich. That is a very mean monkey. Mean Mr. Monkey is doing things. Please stop shooting, Eddie. Okay, the monkey's dead. Moving on. And in an hour, he'll be gone. Who's got the mining again? Okay, yeah, Eddie the miner. Shuttle arrives. Okay. And Dronos, get in the shuttle. Good. Free holder title gained by Eddie. Uh, Eddie's yeoman ceremony. Do I need anything? Imperium of Eternity is ready to grant Eddie the title of Yeoman. Power of one site link. Bestower will arrive. Bestower will only give in any th uh, give a title if any throne room requirements are satisfied. There's a chance of getting an extra honor depending on how many viewers attend. You can betray, uh, but this will make the Imperium your enemy. If you miss, there'll be another opportunity. Store or guards are harmed, there will be consequences. What is needed? I think I can do it. And I've got heat strong. Alright. Now, quest link. on getting this cooler built. Who's got our best construction? Eddie again. Oh, start Opvals. Opvals? Opvals? Start the ceremony to begin the ceremony. Okay. I just had to wait for them to, like, I don't know, stretch their legs or something. So, first get the cooler built, then we can get the uh, ceremony going. Alrighty. Yeah, falling much better. Okay. Well, Fallas, let's do this. Room impressiveness due to extreme temperature. Well, that's just ducky. Guys, go ahead and dig some rocks for now. Yeah, that's fine. bed out of the way and they can dig over here all right zones 
manage areas. We'll rename zone one indoors. And this way, if we're ever in a, oh, this is a dangerous situation, I can have the monkey run indoors. And I believe there's a pet bed. Furniture. Pet bed. Pet bed. Animal sleeping box. There we go. I'll go ahead and put it down here for now. faster if you uh, actually set the clock to fast. over. environment. Well, boo frickety who? Hideous environment. This place is unbearably grotesque. I can't look at it at this anymore. Wow. Okay, so it's ugly and it's rough rock. So that's why she don't like it. Gotcha. Gotcha, rough rock right here. <laughs> Pow, right in the kiss. I mean, I was planning on building floors and shit. Damn. Everybody's a critic. Actually, I don't need to be doing steel walls anymore. I've got granite I can use now. Here, which, yes, fair enough, but damn. Need a research project. All right. Um, let us go ahead and learn how to make pemmican, I think. Yeah, because that'll let us do long lasting food and stuff and foodstuffs. Structure. We'll do. 
granite door. Because we don't have a lot of wood right now. is over. And a group of travelers is passing by. That's cool. Are good social six okay loca treat thank you for no longer being psycho or whatnot please go get us stuff um i'll sell them the pants because no one else is gonna wear them for a while and medicine's always good and Food's always good. Oh. Oh. Okay, I was about to say, Loka, did... Could you, I don't know... Bring the medicine that you just bought? <laughs> no? Okay, then. Fennec Fox Hunting Tailor. Alright. Where is the Fennec Fox? Up there. Alright. So, Doggo, we tried peaceful coexistence. Um, this is on you now. Someone to be streamological director. Oh, ritual spoke there. We go. Okay. Um, we'll put that there. Hmm. Wait, what does this director do? Moral guide. And is in charge of stuff like conversion, so probably want the person with the best social, which is Loka. Oh, okay. Uh, Loka, do you want to attend your big poobah ceremony? Loka talked about responsibility. Talked about taking responsibility. Explained her new role in the community. Discussed her shortcomings. Offered thoughts on the s social structure. Uh, strengths and how to leverage them. Described her shortcomings. <laughs> Explained improving the colony. Offered thoughts on her dedication of her beliefs. There we go. Hooray! Oh, goody. Health. Doctor in the house. Yes, please. Uh, tend to Taylor? 
No Taylor? Alrighty then. Immunity is at 13%. So as long as that trend keeps on going, we'll be fine. Eddie's doing stuff over there. Taylor's healing up. Loka is digging. I'll go ahead and put a bed in there and a bed in there. This way they're not sleeping in barracks. They've each got their own bed. Or they could sleep in the barracks for one more night. yeoman ceremony. Anyone got enough plants yet? Two, two, one. So the answer is no. And once Eddie wakes up, is up and running. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. All right. Placa. Any old time you want. We can do this. There we go. Taylor, his infection's at 80%, but that's fine because he's just about healed. Unimpressive bestowing ceremony. It's 20%. Uh, no extra honor since there weren't many spectators. Um, yep, it's kind of what I expected. Now, Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. to do things I believe I've never really dealt with the um, with the royalty content I never really gave too much of a about it so this is really kind of my not first blush but uh, yeah kind of my first time that I'm actually dealing with it Requesting colonists. Can I spare anyone right now? Let's take a look. Hi, Stellar uh, Constance Lascaris of. Uh, da -da. Uh, need extra hands. Two colonists for 28 days. How about no? 
toxin unit. Smash up. Chemical fascination and nudist. So we are not keeping you. Um, all right. Her buddy. Over here. spot over by the anima tree. his finger off. And he's dead. Good job, team. Let's dig another hole. Sandy Pantalones. Anytime you want to chop wood, that'd be pretty cool. Or, you know, take a nap, whatever. Works for me. Ooh, punk's bed closer to Taker. Whose bed is this? Eddie's. Who is our cook? Loka. Alright. Um. Ooh, Bulk's Good Trader from Roka Coalition. Alright. First, I'm gonna do this. Then, I'm gonna do this. And. Loka. Deal with Roka. Who's got a break risk? Loka. Oh, because of the whole, eee, it's ugly. Yeah. All right, so we'll sell this and that. And buy some pemmican. Is there anything I want? Not clothing wise, maybe some wood. can afford it, yeah. Not that much, though. So I'm gonna say a hundred of that. No, actually. Food, always good. Um, wood, just, come on, guys, go chop some. Loka, if you think it's ugly, then put down some floors.
Even better, Taylor. He's pretty old. Oh, apparel. We need a cape for you. Cape, cape, cape. Um. Guys, could you, could you, I don't know. Maybe. Thank you. <laughs> Gift from Roca Coalition. Oh, sorry about your crops burning. Here's some plasteel. So that's Taylor. That it. And what's on fire? Oh, that is. Okay, that's not that big a deal. It's way over here. Minor break. Inside the environment. I'm not comfortable. Well, go sit on a chair or something. Jeez. Not your mother. Uh, tint corn has rotted. Due to it being ready, but nobody picked it because it's overly dramatic. wants you to take care of her favorite pet, the tortoise jet, for eight days. We get a lot of medicine. Or we could just get in good with the Empire, or we could get more Oh no. I'm thinking... Yeah, let's do it for the medicine. All right, jet. Paralytic abasia. Neurological condition that makes a person unable to walk. Patients recover naturally, but the process is slow. So we will give him another sleeping spot. And Eddie, if you'd be so kind as to rescue him. Thank you, Eddie. Back to your regularly scheduled uh, wall smoothing. Should be fairly easy. Mm, right. I would like to remove that roofing because I don't want to run the risk of having my people be all like, oh, hey, let's keep on digging. And then, oh, boom, whole thing just falls apart. Roof collapse. Visitor's relationship. Group from Herterian, uh, Herterinor, Hertinor. Yeah, H-Town are visiting the colony. They seem to have a few items to trade. There are people who have relationships with your colonists or a prisoner in the arriving group. Uh, villager Dadu, Dadu is the aunt of Loka. So Dadu, Loka's aunt. Loka can trade with McCarthy. 
when she's done digging that. All right. Medicine, Yayo. Uh, you have nothing I want. So, yeah, we're good. And we will put that here. And we'll put this in here. And we'll put the rocks there. And start lining up the uh, walls with stuff that's not crap. Smooth, smooth, smoothing, smooth. Hey, smooth walls. Want to see my smooth walls? Gift. A recurve bow. How lovely. Um, I'll give it to Eddie. There we go. And Eddie, if you'd be so kind as to put that knife away. Thank you. And we'll do another steel door, I think. Each of those. Oh, God. oh, right. We need we need things and stuff. Um, who's our plant person? Everybody's a plant person. And then Eddie will be the tailor. Once we have, you know, fabric. Uh, Cougar was going to eat punk. And now it's going to eat lead. Oh, I was about to say, Eddie, what are you doing? But... Eddie is going to go and meditate for a bit. Hooray! And with 137 wood, I think we can do some floors. Make it look a little bit nicer so Loka stops having such a conniption over me. It's ugly. so we can sell it to the next set of traders. Um, Taylor, if you'd be so kind as to get that fox fur. Thank you. Now we can actually go ahead and give Taylor his own room. That way we don't have to worry about Eddie and Loka wandering past him and keeping him awake. Because that just makes people cranky. Ooh, 
that's going to take a while. Jet, how you doing? Still paralyzed. That's fine. So we're going to keep food on this shelf. And we're not going to keep food on these other shelves. That's what I think. Hopeless travelers, let's see. Oh, hey. Uh, Riku is approaching with a child in tow. They say that Crop Blight has starved them out of their village, begs for permission to stay at Streamland for seven days so they can rest and regroup. In return, they offer to work and fight for free. If you make them happy, some may join, may offer to join. They may also reward you later for helping them, but there is no way of knowing their true intentions. These refugees are not part of any faction. If you wish, you can choose to kill, arrest, sell, or harvest them without diplomatic consequences. Yeah, let's do it. We got Riku, and we've got Mastic, the pig child. Uh, tattered apparel. Let's go ahead and get them a couple of beds here. Fight, be a patient, get some sleep, take care of the kid. Um, yeah, basic stuff, handling, yeah, we'll let Taylor keep on doing that. Loka, you can go ahead and cook now. Uh, Riku, if you would be so kind as to deal with plant stuff. You can go ahead and do artsy fartsy stuff. Eddie, if you'd be so kind as to, oh, I don't know, make them furniture so they're not sleeping on the damn floor. and the other one will get a steel bed. Uh, go ahead and wear that. There we go. 
know. Clear that force. Alright. Not ideology. We'll go with a stylite station. Yep, there it is. Do we have a small table I can use? Currently do not. Are there any in the ruins? No. I have not seen any tables. Oh wait, here's a table. We'll click this table. I don't really care. Oh, it's all the way over here. Wait, where is this? Compared to us? Isn't it? I have no idea. Oh, it is way over here. Yeah, we're not going that way. Um, betrayal offer from Red. The Roca Coalition. Nah, we're not going to do that. You can hate them all you want, but, you know, for crying out loud. They're refugees. Leave them alone. Since I have so much steel, I believe I can actually do windmills, yeah. Wind turbine. Then I can do power. like coolers and speaking of coolers how's the temperature not bad not bad yeah so far so good Research. How's the pemmican learning going? Not bad. Um, yeah, I was gonna say, Riku, could you wait? Your crop skill is under five. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, did you just get to it? Okay, yeah, looks like it just came up to five. I see. Yeah, Riku, you keep on doing you. Taylor, you're becoming slightly less of a dumbass. Styling. Okay, Loka. Let's go ahead and change up your style. You enjoy... What's your favorite color again? That kind of... That color. Oh, reset that. Apparel color. There we go. And we will... Okay, 
so three fifths would be okay so two would be 50 percent three would be 75 percent so we'll go ahead and dye these like that and then loka should get a mood boost for wearing her favorite color favorite color. It's not much, but it's something. Punk, you have a bed. But it's not in the home zone. Ah, sorry, Punk. floors here. Mm. Oh goody. Every female colonist feels a wave of anxiety and anger. Some distant engine of hatred is stirring. It is projecting a psychic drone onto the site that through an orbital amplifier tuned to only affect females. For a few days, some people's moods will be, excuse me, quite a bit worse. The drone level is low. Well, isn't that just lovely? Misogynistic bastard. You guys go ahead and stay indoors. And you other three come on over here. Nice thing is all of these weapons have a what longer range than um, the shotgun so even though the shotgun does more damage we should be able to kite this guy around all right who's he oh <laughs> he's attacking no one because he's dead D-D-D. dead. All right, and another hole in the sand. And you guys are free to roam. Well, stay close. style. Okay, you're currently psyching up over there at the tree. Oh, that's a bison. Alright. No, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. We'll do 
that for the contrast. Taylor. Once Eddie's done coloring their stuff, we'll go ahead and queue you up. All right. So when Taylor wakes up, we'll have them do their own stuff. doesn't have enough dye to dye all of his clothing but we've got some more stuff that we can harvest here soon enough oh sweet we can put jet on the shuttle and then we'll get our glitter medicine Get your toy out of here. Eddie, if you'd be so kind as to haul that. And you, someone has eaten uh, Uday's, Uday's head. When did that happen? Was that the Rat who did that? I'm gonna have to go back and watch that. Let's, um, let's have somebody dig that hole in the dirt, how about? That's just kind of messed up. and Mastic have tattered clothing, but that's not my fault. And they're all hungry. Um, hmm. Let's go ahead and just go a-hunting. Emus are dangerous, so let's go hunting the smaller stuff for now. Eddie is in a daze because they're very hungry. I didn't realize that the food had run out. Agave. Beavers! A group of hungry alpha beavers has just arrived. Try to eliminate them before they decimate every last source of wood in the region. Alrighty, well... When life gives you starvation, hunt some beavers. All right, so that's tomorrow morning's project. You've got a reprieve for now, critters. <laughs> in the arid shrubland. They are not going to do very well even if we don't hunt them. Psychic drone is ending.
vents. There to just kind of keep the t room temperature similar. my furnace and stuff like that. Hmm. What? Refugee died revenge. What? Majestic, one of the desperate uh, has died. What the hell happened? Malnutrition. Oh my god. Oh. Hey, Fox. Good timing. Um, I just let some refugees starve to death. Oh, uh, that is. Was that a little difference in diarrhea? Um, poopy. I let my food situation get away from me in my colony, and, and, uh, um, yeah, yeah. Uh, we killing kids? Yeah. Unintentionally, I am. I am allowing children to starve to death, um, which made Riku very mad, and he is now uh, bleeding out. Oh, no, not bleeding out. He's just injured. Um, damn, that's uh, messed up. That was not my intention. <sighs> we'll put another hole out in the sand here. Rip. hunting beaver. Oh, right, that beaver's hungry. Kim Jong-un, pet you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, didn't mean to. <laughs> All right. All right, so Taylor, um, Damn, and I was just about to get food. I suppose I need more wood, though, to get the electric stove thingy going. That's what they all say. Yeah, time to make more babies. Well, well, unfortunately, this was just one of those... Um, hey, you have no people who can do these things? How about we give you a temporary colonist sort of quest? And it's like, oh, okay. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and make this a prisoner bed and we'll have Taylor capture you. And then we'll just set it up where you get to be. Um, Are you actually any good? Do we want to keep you? No, you're a wimp. We are a psychopath. There's actually a positive trait out here. Um, no, that wimp is just too, too much. Um, go ahead and just reduce his will since it's not that high to begin with and then when he's healthy we can go ahead and let him go yeah we'll do that no longer incapable of walking that's good has gotten food poisoning from corn. Cause dangerous food type. Who knew corn was so dangerous? <sighs> Alright, are you healthy, Eddie? Go ahead and patch him up. Every 
everybody, just cut all the wood that you can. Just give me all that wood. Not the first time I've said that, won't be the last time. And then we are going to cancel the anima tree because I don't feel like listening to a psychic scream. I just want to take a moment to acknowledge what happened here. Eddie walked in the door and then just threw up right next to the prisoner. That's a, that's a hell of a scene. I suppose I probably could have um, switched and been like, oh, hey, yeah, I'll take that betrayal contract, thank you. The Deserter. Uh, Hemerius Ak Akaskos, disgraced officer calling from nearby, deserter in the army of Imperium of Eternity, hunted by a loyalty squad, wishes to join you. Um, Knows the location of key outposts. We'll make enemies of the Empire. They're not... Hmm. Only accept if you wish to fight against the Imperium and develop your Psycasters on your own. I don't think so, because they scary. Go ahead and bury the child. <laughs> okay. Taylor, you may move your bed. Yes, uh, you totally have resources to take on an entire Imperium. Yeah, you say that, and you just now are burying the kid? Look, I'm not the one who sets their priorities. They're just, you know, there. Like, I've even got... Let's see, is it... Please tell me that, like, burying is... Oh, it's because construction was lower down. And we didn't have, a, have this grave dug yet. Forced weather for pay. You monster. Yeah. Look, they only had like one or two bits eaten by wild animals. That out here on the rim, that's that's doing pretty good. Um, machine, uh, planetary system, weather control, rainy thunderstorm for 12 days. I could get money, or harp and uranium, or an Eltex vest. Yeah, let's do it for the money, for the goddamn money. You know, I'm I'm used to I'm used to my my modded stuff, okay? Right now this is a vanilla run. All that, all that. Eddie 
is just staring into the fire, going, what sort of monster lets a child's corpse rot and be eaten by animals? <laughs> Shaman Merchant from Roka Coalition. Alright, uh, Loka, go talk to the Rokas. Alright, what you got? Pemmican. Yes. Let's not repeat that. Thank you very much. Herbal medicine, Nutramine, goat. Goat? Do I want to sell anything? Yeah, I don't have a need for plasteel right at this moment. I know I will later on. Uh, components. No, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna build up my food stores stores. Speaking of pemmican, um. Monkey. You may have What the? Oh! <laughs> the pig got hit by lightning. Soaking wet. Everything sucks. I know, okay? I'm working on it. Let's just have everybody do like all the priorities. And if something suddenly is not a priority, then you know. Probably both be very good ideas. Let's put that there. Okay. We can go ahead and put Luca's bed down here. You're whining about, yeah, my bedroom sucks. At least it has a floor, partially. You got floors, don't you? Um, Loka, could you make sure that the Glitter World medicine is, you know, not rotting outside? Thank you. on a spinning. Wait. Oh, right. This is the wrong side of the planet. Right? Yeah. Where the hell are we again? Yeah, we're over here. There we go. Streamland.
better have eaten the monkey kill. Good, good. You did. You did. Wild man wanders in. Okay. We'll keep kibble here. Make it important. A person living among wild animals have wandered has wandered into the area. He's called Chomnos. You can attempt to tame him. Are you damn? Or like chunky? No. Greedy, cannibal, royal bastard, illegal shipwright. Pretty good construction, decent social. Um, nobody else has construction like that, so yeah, yeah. Let's have the cannibal come in. See, they're doing another Fallen Order game. Yeah, yeah, I did see that. Uh, I did see that, Fox. Um, I am ambivalent about it just because I don't like Souls games. So, you know, for those who enjoyed it, uh, you know, great. Um, I hear, I heard really good things about the storyline itself, but, you know, I'm just not a Souls fan, so it, I'm not particularly interested in it. this uh, next week, there's at least two mods that I'm going to do. One is simple sidearm, so people can have a ranged weapon and a melee weapon. The other one, I think, is going to be the minify everything, so I can actually, you know, pick up stuff and bring it somewhere else, because those are just, that should almost be like base game stuff at this point, in my opinion. I have no idea. So we'll actually make this Chomnos's bed. And Eddie, if you'd be so kind as to build Loka a better bed. Thank you. Alright. Uh, Chomnos, we would like you. Let's see, what's your stuff? Loyalist and Collectivist. Yeah, it's kind of poopy. Um, can we convert you? 5%? Ow. Oh. Can we convert you this way? Probably not. And yeah, let's try this first. Jomnos the Nicky Man. Gloria, uh, Loka described the future of mankind, offered the righteousness of belonging, spoke of mankind's history, talked about right and wrong. One of us, one of us, gobble gobble, gobble gobble. Uh, love and hate, and it was ineffective. In fact, it made him go from mostly thinking his way was the right way to totally being convinced. So, yay! That was worth it. Alright. 
my schedule. Now then, where were we? Ah, yes. The pit of eternal despair. And now Chomnos gets to be uh, the food poison due to a uh, terrible chef. Isn't that great, everybody? Alright, wind keeps on blowing. Wind well, keeps on turning. Oh, and since we have electricity, we can also do that. Put some AC on. for an impressive bedroom. And you are frail and have an artery blockage. Good God, we are just bad in a thousand with you, aren't we? Oh, great. What 
let's break in now. Probably make him some clothes too. unit. They're attacking immediately. Hooray! Oh, that's just my guy. Right. We'll go ahead and set up here, I think. Brave, are you actually any good? Uh, it doesn't matter. You're unwaveringly North. Okay. So we'll set up a little ambush here, methinks. Okay. Posting a friend. Uh, Red Skuamka, Universe Chief of Roka Co uh, Coalition, favor, interested in learning other cultures, won't do any work, we'll gain goodwill, and we get Sar. Sar, any good. Pyromaniac, fuck that noise. I thought you were being quiet. I had somehow muted you. I missed the answer to that question. Oh, about the Fallen Order game? Um, I have heard about them doing a sequel. I'm not particularly interested, just because I don't like Souls games. You know, I gave it a shot the one time, and it's just... Souls games are not for me. Um, and yeah, so I hear good things about the storyline and everything, but I just... I don't care for Souls games. Man, I loved it. Yeah, and to each their own, you know. I have that, but uh, yeah, it's a no from me, dog. Yes, and let's see, perfect mix of Souls and Star Wars, in my opinion. Um, yes, for you and your opinion, that's perfectly fine. For me, it's like any is too much for me, so yeah. However, if you were to play it, you know, on stream, I, I, I could be, I could probably be convinced to join you. Um, but uh, yeah, it's just, I just don't like Souls games. They did put it on, uh, the did put it an easy mode. They gave it an easy mode? Yeah. That's fine. I just, yeah, I'm just not much of a, uh, like I said, I just keep on coming back to not a Souls guy. But I will tell you what I am. I am a, let's give this, uh, person a grave, because I don't want them stinking up the place. Sort of guy. Not even to get a good Star Wars story. I can read about it. I can fig learn that sort of stuff. You know? Yeah. Yeah, because I never, I never, I, um, you remember the one time I did try to stream the original, uh, Fallen Order? And I didn't rage quit, but I stopped playing it. Um, that's all I played it, of it. And it's like, okay, you know, we went around doing stuff and fighting inquisitors and great and I know about the big oh my god I don't like souls games <laughs> like I I have so many examples of like oh this is a good Star Wars uh, story 
I can go and enjoy those. <laughs> I will say though, I am needing to catch up on season three of The Mandalorian. I am so far behind on stuff. Um, I feel like what I might be doing is, uh, what is word? I'm kind of, not so much pulling, yeah, for lack of a better term, I'll go with pulling back from Star Wars a little bit just because it's starting to get like the Marvel movies and the comic uh, and my problem with the Marvel movies is that they were getting too much to be like the Marvel comics where it's like oh I don't want to have to constantly consume everything with it like I want to be able to just kind of pop into this one thing and and deal with that um that's kind of why I stopped watching the Marvel movies I didn't want to have to figure out like okay now is this important because I didn't see, you know, Thor 47 or whatever. And I know, yeah, um, I know that, oh, they try to keep them, uh, you know, standalone. Yes, but. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just whining. Um, You're proud of Chumbo's. Greedy for impressive. Yes, yes. Uncover boy. Look, there are pants right here. If you're not wearing them, that's on you. In fact, oh, you want, you want your pants? Have some fucking pants. Pants wear. Rice is
Nobody need more toxin units. Alright. Preparing. And one guy with an X. Gotcha. not dead. Cool. You are a wimp, though. And you're sickly. Ooh, yeah, no, we're, we're just gonna take your stuff and maybe, if we're kind, we'll patch you up and let you wander out on your own. Yeah, your stuff is terrible. Um, strip. you might actually want something that doesn't have, like, dead guy taint on it. probably go around the map and I forbid the stuff that I actually want brought over. Wanted to break. 
break your stuff. Gold mining worksite controlled by the Grey Mink Camzo. Don't know what the Grey Mink Camzo is. The gray mean Kimzo? Let us look. Gray mean Kimzo. I've never met the gray mink. So I'm guessing I hate them. my best Taylor. It's Eddie. I'm gonna have Eddie focus on Taylor stuff, I think. And we'll also go ahead and move this zone of storing things down here. Rhinoceros self tamed. It is now designated Rhinoceros 1. Oh, goody. Well, that means I need a hitching spot. Because otherwise, it'll wander away. Also, need. place where I can grow some grass and also build a barn. I think we'll go up here.
this one barnyard. And we'll call this one barn. This one we'll call outdoors. Okay, I think that works. Fiesta of Barquism, Opportunity, the campfire or ritual spot. Sky lanterns will get chopped up by the wind turbine. Doesn't look like it. Unimpressive. Everybody's kind of pissy. That's great. Very low expectations. Only four people participating. Well, that's all of you. <laughs> Both good traders. Doka, if you could make us some money, please. leathers, and go juice, because the last thing I need is a bunch of druggies on my hands. Let's go ahead and sell all of this, too. All right. I'm going to 
little bit more food too. Yeah, at least they like us a little bit more now. Psychically dull, can't care. Good with animals, good with social. Oh, right, right. Um, animals use need the pen. Chomnos, or no, Taylor, if you'd be so kind as to rope them up so they don't wander away. Poisoning because of course she does. Shumnos, if you'd be a deer and you know, bring in that cloth that's just rotting out in the fields, that'd be great. Racist tropes. Well, just the two. Loka, what are you pissy about? Intense pain. Oh, right from the food poisoning. Gotcha. Unified fair. Take a look at get, getting some chance. Oh, that's for a party. Gotcha. Okay, you have a different cave. Oh, you have an excellent cave. Let's get you back your. controller is no longer changing weather that's cool
has orbited in front of the sun. An eclipse has begun. It's not really a big deal for me because I don't have solar panels. Now I have hem uh, pemmican. What can I make? Medicine production, we need microelectronics and drug production. Drug production just needs some research. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and set that up. And move forward from there. And yeah. Okay. Um Yeah, I'm realizing I have been streaming for a little over three hours now, um, and I can kind of feel my the brain. Uh, excuse me, I can kind of feel my brain um, starting to not shut down, but the uh, the battery. My, I feel like my battery's a little bit tapped at this point. So what I think I am going to go ahead and do is I think I'm going to go ahead and call this stream, um, and. Then I'm gonna see if I can figure out what the heck was going on with Valheim, why it wouldn't launch properly. Um, yeah, uh, and uh, we'll see next week. You know, might pick up with this. Otherwise, might pick up with Valheim and try to get farther along to the uh, Guardian of the Forest uh, boss there. Uh, but yeah, I'm open. Um, and yeah, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else. Feel free to. Like, comment, subscribe? I don't know. This isn't YouTube. Wait a minute. This is Twitch. Um, but yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll be back next week. In the meantime, thanks for watching.